Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm going to show you how to subtract a mixed number from a whole number. So, the first thing we want to do is rewrite this with two fractions, because then we can simply subtract a fraction from a fraction. So, we can rewrite 7 as a fraction by putting it as 7 over 1, because 7 over 1 is still 7, we are just rewriting it as a fraction. Next, we can rewrite our mixed number as a fraction by converting it to a fraction. You do that by multiplying the denominator by the whole number at the front, and then adding that to the numerator. So we have 3 times 3, which is 9, plus our numerator, which is 1. So that gives us 10, and our denominator will stay as 3. Next, we can solve this subtraction problem. So we have 7 over 1 minus 10 over 3. The first thing we need to do is get a common denominator. More specifically, we need to get the least common denominator. So, the least common denominator of 1 and 3 is 3. So if we rewrite this, to get 7 over 1 with a denominator of 3, we need to multiply the 1 down the bottom by 3, and whatever, and whatever we do to the bottom, we also must do to the top. So that means we multiply the 7 by the 3 as well, and that gives us a new problem of 21 over 3 minus, and then since 10 over 3 already has our least common denominator of 3, it can just stay the same. And now we just have a normal subtraction problem with a fraction subtracted by a fraction. So 21 minus 10 is just 11, and the denominator will stay the same at 3, and that is our answer. But if you want to finish as a mixed number, just look how many times 3 goes into 11. 3 goes into 11 3 times, because 3 times 3 is 9. And then there's a remainder of 2, because 9, 10, 11. So 3 and 2 with our denominator staying as 3. So the answer to this problem where we subtracted a mixed number from a whole number is 3 and 2 thirds. And that brings us to the end of the video. If you found it helpful, make sure to give this video a like, feel free to drop a comment, and please consider subscribing to my channel. And I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day.